Give me that Taurus long stroke. Ah, ah, ah. Give me that Taurus long stroke. Ah, ah, ah. Give me that Taurus long stroke. Ah, ah, ah. Taurus long stroke. Ah. What's up, guys? Like this video. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. I'd love to have you guys back. All right, let's get into the Taurus reading. Let's over our energy for Taurus. Hope you guys are having a happy Friday, guys. Hope you guys are living your best life, man. You know, life is short. You know, live it. Live it, guys. All right, so you could, you could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Somebody will have Sagittarius in their chart, or it doesn't have to be. Um, this person created a lot of bad memories with you, a lot of bad taste in your mouth. This person played a lot of games, probably cheated. This person was very, very attractive, though, um, but they were very, very self-absorbed. Um, manipulative, vindictive, conceited motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? All right. This person here is, um, when it comes to you, they're very, very, um... They're keeping an eye on you. I feel like they're trying to figure out the details, um, trying to figure out, you know, how they can make this work because they're heartbroken since they haven't been with you. Um, I have an earth sign here, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I also have air, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. They want to come out of heartbreak with you. They want to come out of achy, breaky heart with you. You know what I'm saying? They want to put the fucking heartbreak away you see this man here working so damn hard on his coins you see him trying to figure out the details he's like man i'm gonna carve this fucking shit in here i don't i don't like this right here i don't like this shit i look i think i look at this card in reverse as a fucking roach a roach you know what you do with roaches you put them in the hotel and rip their legs off of it and their antennas, you rip them off. And you spray them with the red and they go, oh, oh, oh. And they're trying to breathe for fucking air. That's what I do. The, the queen of wands, all right? But it could be this person just wasn't showing you attention or they're being manipulative, right? I hate looking at selfish, self-absorbed pieces of shit, cold fucking demeanor pieces of shit. Treating my subscribers like this. Let's go ahead and clarify the Eight of Pentacles here before I lose my mind. Up in here, up in here, for the roaches. Meet me outside. Meet me outside. This person has made a choice that they want to move forward with you and make you very happy. All right. All right, all right, all right. This person wants to make you very, very happy. They made a choice to do so. So they were touched by angels. And now they want to make it right with you. Look at that. They've made a choice. At one point, they had their back turned to you. And they weren't being that way. See this Three of Swords. See this Three of Swords. Um, reverse, what does this mean here? Ooh, they want to drink you. They want to drink you so damn bad. Is driving them mad. Give me a little taste of that cup, please. Oh, all right. They wanna, they wanna um, give you a cup of love. All right. What else they wanna do? They were roaches before. Hmm. I think they think also, you know, they think also that um, there's been a lot of negativity around this uh, connection here, and um, it just hasn't been a really, really victorious uh, situation here between y'all. So I think they want to try to bring us back up to good terms here with you. Well, they better, because Taurus, they are loyal for the most part. There are some unloyal Tauruses out there could be you with this card this could be your overall energy this is you know but look 
They're just like, you know. Yeah, they really want to, um, like this, 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 this non-reunion with you is not making them feel good. Yeah, then they want to see you. All right. So what else can you tell me about this person here? They feel like the time they invested um, hasn't brought them justice. So I think, yeah, six, uh, six of Pentacles. Yeah, they definitely want to come in and give you an equal give and take here. All right. They feel like in the past, that a lot of time was wasted. All right. What else keep telling me? I think they think like you've been kind of distant. You haven't really been paying them attention. You've been kind of like in your own zen, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know, good. Oh yeah, they're looking at you. They're like, they could be business owners, business person here. Um, definitely want to give you that message here. Um, they feel you pulling away. They feel like you're not 100% there and they're like where the hell is my queen of fucking cops i want my cops because i'm obsessed with you all right and i want to tear you apart what else hmm i think they may think that you're playing games Cause it comes, it's coming up in their energy, the same over our energy here. Yeah, they want to come out of conflict. They've been sad. They've been really down about this, especially if you're dealing with a Sagittarius or a water sign here. Mm. Yeah, they're gonna message you because they have all, they have fond memories of y'all being together. Okay. All right, what's the emotions behind this person for my Taurus? They may be coming off that they're not, they're not interested or whatever the case may be, but don't don't buy that. Um, they may be a little confused about this situation if you did pull away or whatever the case may be. Yeah, they feel very sad about this connection. Like I said, I saw it in there. Yeah, um, maybe they may, before they come to you, they want to build their confidence up or maybe you help them build, build their confidence up. Yeah, you make them feel happy and they're feeling sad right now. Okay, 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 okay. Get them out the way. Get out the way, motherfucker. I see you're doing a lot of self-caring. I mean, this is like your card right here. You know what I'm saying? The queen of fucking pentacles, making that money, self-sufficient, nurturing other people, um, you know, helping people out who need help. You know, just being a caring overall family person, social person, just fucking... Mm -hmm. It's like you don't want to put the work in because you don't know... It just is going to be a successful relationship. I'm going to ask the question what happened in the past. But I feel like you're going, to, you're going to hear this person out. But you're going to make sure this person isn't on that on that bullshit either. You know what I'm saying? What happened in, what happened in the past here? Let's figure this out here. What happened in the past between y'all two? What in the past between y'all two? I feel like somebody's started holding back was it communicating all right somebody felt like it wasn't like a, um something they wanted to pursue or they were just like acting like you weren't what they wanted but i feel like they're going to come in here and they're going to speak with the ace of swords here okay so this person also um in their person they could be getting bad advice from other rats um yeah They've been withdrawing because they've been getting bad advice. And also there are probably arguments or whatever between y'all two that have made them pull back. 
All right. What else? Oh, they're fucking obsessed. Look at that. I'm obsessed. Oh, I'm obsessed. I can't let you go. I can't let you go. They can't let you go. Yeah, they can't move on from you. No matter what the advice they're getting, you know what I'm saying? They feel like you're starting to pull away from them as well. They can't let you go. They want to tear you all apart. All right. <laughs> what's, their, what's their future actions towards you? What's their future actions towards you? Oh, they want to speak to you. Mm, communication's coming in. Like, damn, I tried to hit a bird, but I, I want to take you back. You know, there's nobody else like you. Queen of Cups. Oh, yeah. I told you they want to tear you apart. They want to do you bad. They want to screw you. Screw you Oh, they're going to be less defensive, too. Mm -hmm. They're going to be opening up to you. Love is in reverse. They feel like, you know, you're losing that love, that passion. So they're coming in here being less defensive, going, oh. Look at that lady in the middle. She's like, oh, my God, I'm waiting for my love to come back. I feel like you're going to be willing to hear this person out. Um, get the Ace of Wands here. Um, you definitely want a new beginning. If it's going to be something that you are going to do again with this person, it has to be something completely different than what they were showing you in the past. It's got to be. All right? If not, this ain't going to be a good time for you. It ain't going to be a good time for you. All right, Taurus? Ah, ah. Oh, shit. You're going to open up to them, but be a little bit guarded. You might at first, like, you know, think about the offer, but you know what I'm saying? You're definitely going to be in your emperor. You're going to be like, you know what? You better fucking, you better fucking um, be on your grown shit, on your grown and sexy. You better be on your grown and sexy coming towards this Taurus here. Because if you ain't grown and sexy, you're going to get your ass kicked the fuck out with your roaches. All right. I feel like you feel like this person is in and out of your life, person in and out of your life, or just not really showing you that kind of attention. I feel like you're going to be spying or at least observing if this person has made a change in their behavior before you say yes. Yeah. All right, what about new all uprights? Somebody's coming in to uh, who's been mirroring you, wants to bring justice to you, judgment, which is re resurrect the relationship. They think about you, even though it's a burden, all right? Well, that's the person who wants to come back. All right, so what about new? There is a person here who wants to give you a message, but they it's like they don't know if they want to do it or not. Earth sign, air sign here. They may feel like you're a player is or something like that. But they don't know a lot about you. All right. Could be an Aries. You know what I'm saying? They've been watching you. They want to be getting with you. All right. <laughs> Spiritual guide messages. All right. Time for some action. Action. Take charge. Leave by example. Walk. You'll talk. Which I'm sure Tauruses can do. They're the move of the Zodiac, the cow. All right. Shine your light. Your internal guidance is coming through loud and clear. Yep. Intuition, baby, baby, baby. is so fucking light. You can't even see the motherfucker. 
He's got that Michael Jackson tan. Um, remember that only love is real. Miracles will occur naturally. Spirit has your back. Spirit has your member the time. Your back. All right, let's get your mantra for the day. You don't have to rebuild a relationship with everyone you have forgiven. It says... You are hereby granted permission to forgive everyone, but still be super picky about every person you let into your inner circle. Go forth and be prosperous. All right. I don't know what you're going to do, man. This person wants to come out of this heartbreak with you. And I think you might be interested, all right? Call upon the tarot gods and end this motherfucker right now. I do what you want to do. If you like this video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. I'd love to have you guys back. Bye.